Hello, welcome to another one. Trapping is a great way for a person to get outside and spend time in nature. The veteran trappers make finding good set locations and setting traps look like a walk in the park, but in reality, trapping is intimidating for beginners. The new trappers don't be dismayed. Trapping is incredibly rewarding and fun, and eventually you will be just as good as those veterans at skinning and fleshing. Today we'll be talking about the top three animals for beginners. Before we start, please take a moment to like and subscribe. Because of subscribers like you, we were able to get monetized, so every view on our videos and view on the ads before helps support this channel. Your support allows us to give you the content you enjoy. Along those lines, all our videos have affiliate links to the products we use such as cameras, traps, dyes, baits, and stretchers. If you use those links, we get a small stipend, and that goes directly to the video making process. Now back to the video. The third best animal to trap for beginners is the coyote. Learning scent control is very important for new trappers, and coyote trapping is a great way to figure that out. Beginners can hone their skills while trapping for yotes as their sense of smell is great. By trapping coyotes, a person will definitely learn what they can and can't get away with in regards to leaving scent. You can read all you want online, but until you try trapping for coyotes in your area, you won't know for sure what works. Different areas and different coyotes can act differently to urines and bait smells, and can be more or less skittish to human smells. Coyotes can be a great way to decipher what works best for the beginner. Another reason why coyotes are great for beginners is that bigger traps can be found cheap. Sometimes one can find free coyote traps from giveaways at conventions or cheap used traps can be found online. A little bit of research is needed prior to purchasing traps as beginner trappers will eventually figure out the average price for traps and will know when a good deal pops up. Having an experienced trapper advise for the first purchase is great, or many will lend a few traps to get started. The emotional payoff for coyotes is great, and can hook a beginner for life. Having such a large catch in your first trap is quite rewarding. The additional upside to coyotes is that other animals such as raccoons, fox, and even bobcats can be caught in the same sets. Finally, coyotes are on the higher side in regards to money per pelt. If you want to learn more about the best animals for money, check out our recent video titled Top 3 Animals to Trap for Profit. Number 2 on our list of animals for beginner trappers is the raccoon. Raccoons are an animal that almost everyone starts out trapping due to the quantity of the critters and the ease of trapping. An easy way for new trappers to trap raccoons is with dog groups. These are great traps for beginners and even long time trappers due to the ease of setting and the low price. Because dog proofs are so easy to set, a long trap line is incredibly easy to start and maintain. As the name suggests, a new trapper never has to worry about accidental canine catches, which can be quite distressing to a new trapper. The dog proof trap can only be triggered by a grasping raccoon or opossum paw. Dogs lack the agile fingered paw that raccoons have and cannot get caught in the traps. When using these traps, mice can steal the bait, but this can be avoided by placing a rock or golf ball over the top. Raccoons can still smell the bait and will push the ball or rock off the top. Dog proofs are meant to be seen and can be placed in the middle of the trail with minimal effort. Another way to trap raccoons is to use cheap footholds such as 1.5 coils. These can be very effective and can catch other animals like skunks or opossums. These sets help new trappers start trapping by learning how to blend in sets with dirt and learn other trapping basics. If you're looking at buying new equipment or traps, check out the Amazon affiliate links below for some good deals and also to help out the channel at no extra cost to you. Raccoons are not picky about food or scent control. They will eat dog food out of the trap or basically whatever is put in there. We here at Outdoor Experiences use cheap dog food with bacon grease mixed in for a good smell that travels. Fleshing raccoons can be difficult due to their fat content, but this makes for a great practice. If a trapper can skin and flesh a raccoon, most other animals can be completed with ease. If anything, skinning and freezing the raccoon is enough until they can be sold to a buyer. Finally, the number one animal for beginners to trap is the muskrat. 
Muskrats typically live in areas with dense populations. This means that one stop at a slough or lake can lead to numerous muskrat huts and therefore many muskrats and traps. The limited budget of young and beginner trappers can be difficult to overcome, but many pelts can be had with one stop. Muskrats are incredibly easy to skin. The repetition of completing many muskrat pelts through skinning, fleshing, and stretching carries over to other types of animal pelts. The ease in which muskrats can be skinned eliminates the early frustration of tearing or cutting other fur berries' fur before being fluent in the process. Muskrat traps are cheap and forgiving. The smaller traps may clamp on a finger but will rarely leave a bruise, unlike the stronger beaver or coyote traps. Being caught in a muskrat trap allows a beginner to remain calm when in the trap and be able to think their way through opening the jaws for release. That skill is great when being clamped by a larger trap. Building up from small traps to become more competent and competent with the bigger traps is essential for beginner trappers. Typically, muskrats are the starting animal for most water trappers, as it is fun and easier than most other animals. The time spent trapping and skinning muskrats are low in comparison to other fur bearers. The price for muskrats combined with the high numbers makes muskrats a great money fur. The low time spent also keeps new trappers interested and makes trapping fun. Thanks again for watching this episode of Outdoor Experiences. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments below. And if you have any tips for beginner trappers, leave them in the comments as well. Don't forget to like and share this video and subscribe to the channel. And we'll see you on the next one.